everyone from 200 Maine. As you can see, we're all getting used to wearing our masks. I won't have to for this video. Welcome to our fourth in our series of videos. We've done several that show and highlight the 40 different artists that we have here. I think we're on our 30th um, artist. So come and look at what we've been doing, and that is sharing with you specific artwork that is for sale, you can, you can certainly buy. I keep carrying this around to let you know that you simply have to email us at 200mainec at gmail.com. So come on and look at our first of 10 pieces today. The first piece you've probably seen in some other areas. Keith Wyman is a Minneapolis artist. Keith does very unique concrete, wood, and steel tables. This is a seat with angled bars for $2,500. It happens that our second artist, George we met, who's from Door County area, George is an art teacher and did this um, free form ceramic called Mountain Crossing that is 700. And as we raise up, you can see number three, Bruce Scott is an artist from Seattle, used to be from Eau Claire, and he's done these two pieces. This first one is Gray Shadows, that's 950, and the other piece is Dakota Creek, and that is 1,000. So join me as we walk across to number four. <clears throat> Pat Ham. So we, we all know and love Pat Ham. In her mixed media, what she's done here is a number. She numbers all of her pieces. This is 1,056, and this piece sells for 125. I haven't included prices, but this one is about 12 by 12. So we'll come over here to number five. Number five, as you can see all this other great art. Uh, number five is Joe Maurer. Joe is a fixture in Eau Claire. He's painting with oils on board. This first one is Neighborhood Miracle for $100. These are about six by six, really precious paintings. And the second one is Martha, West Side. Oil on board <clears throat> for 100 there as well. And we have a relatively new artist over here. <clears throat> and her name is Kathleen Rulka. She does free form ceramics. This one is number six. This one is called Reflection, and that is $650. It's about 13, 14 inches tall. And then just over here is um, somewhat of a commemorative piece because Bob Gerke was a very revered artist until he passed away a little over a year ago. This is one of Bob's finest pieces. It's called Bird in the Hand. You can see the detail of the sculpted bronze and that is 5,000, a beautiful piece. And we'll move into our next room as you kind of get a glimpse of some of the other art. So within this, um, Sue Zimple works just down the street. She does coaster sets and other alcohol inks. These smaller sets are 35 and the bigger ones are 30. This one in the back is a little longer as well. Many pieces like that. And then above this is Lars Nielsen. Lars is from Oliva. He's a Swedish wonderful clockmaker and works with wood. These are phone stands as well. So these wonderful clocks are handmade, 150. The layered clocks, like the one on the left, is 225. And then our last artist over here is Kathy O'Leary. She does tiles. She's also done some felting. Um, Kathy's pieces are of cardinals, and they vary in size a little bit, but generally they're four or five by five tiles for $20 each. So you've had another run, another chance to see our pieces. We'll be doing more of this, but please do email us at 200mainec at gmail.com. Let us know what you like, spread the word. You can always like us on Facebook as well. So we hope you're all staying well and sane, and we'll see you soon. This too shall pass.